I think it's one of those things where, you know, like Neil Young had his Live at Massey Hall record. And when you listen to it now, part of what you're imagining is, what was it like to be in the audience of Massey Hall on one of those nights? And I think when people walk into Massey Hall, they're like, this could be one of those nights. And so there is, I think, a sense of presence from every person who's there. I, that's, that's kind of my take on it, is that I always think of what would it have been like to be in Massey Hall the night that that song was played for the first time, like down by the river or whatever it was, Old Man. Or, and, and I think people may not necessarily have that intimate relationship maybe with Neil Young or with whoever has played here over the years, but when they walk in, I think there's something about the, like, the sense that great artistic moments in music have happened here, and tonight could also be one of those moments.
opening for Ron Sexsmith and the best part of the whole thing was that I was so tour weary I had been playing and touring my ass off and and I was so fucking I remember being so cranky that day I was and I threw my sunglasses out on the sidewalk and broke them I was being a total little little bitch but the best part about it was I didn't have time I was so tired, I didn't have time to think about playing Massey. And then before you knew it, the show started, and I realized where I was. And then I was already, I was too far into the show to worry too much about it. It ended up being one of the most amazing nights for me to be able to play that room and not be hung up on the fact of where I was. And tonight's a different story. I'm a little nervous. I haven't played in a while. And uh, this is a, a yeah. <laughs> And this is a, a new song that we, we've not played before. So thank you very much for being so wonderfully patient. This is about my ex-husband. to be 
changed too much You didn't change I'm so sorry for everything But early days we were playing the horseshoe And I was drinking too much whiskey Um, or are burned out from performing, that 60 to 80 percent of that reason is because mm -hmm. being in a venue that sucks wears on your soul. Musicians spend their whole lives in venues. It's a gift. Like, you don't know how nice it is when you have a clean dressing room or you have facilities. You know, you've given up your home life or some sense of stability to be there and perform for people. We're gonna quit if we can't perform in venues that, that like fill up our, you know, our soul. And this is one of them, so it's so cool. The hottest days of the summer brought us here together in all its
Bryson on guitar.
I turned 40 in July. So I figured I have to write a song about being in my 30s. So here we go. But for 39 years I was keeping my options open. And for 39 years I was keeping my options open. I cleared out of town to walk the clear mind. 